Anthony McGallum thrives off competition at Palmview High School. He played basketball and participated in track and field. However, his time on the hardwood put his athletic career in jeopardy. The former Lobo loves to leap. His path to success in track and field hit a roadblock before it even began. A basketball injury during his senior season of high school left him sidelined for a long period of time. I blew out all the ligaments in my ankle. I broke my fibula and of course my back had an issue. Um, that was three different surgeries. I had to get screws in my ankle. I had to get a surgery for my back. A lot of injury time. In spite of his setbacks, McGowan was determined to compete in college, although he had several naysayers. Everyone pretty much had their mindset on someone who has back surgery. There's no way he can come back. Um, you know, high jump. I think that really involves landing on your back, lifting from my back, doing all that kind of stuff. You're thinking about it? He was primarily a sprinter his first two years. At the beginning of this season, he was given the green light oh, nope. to focus on the high jump. I was ready for it. High jump's actually really fun to me and it's really technical, so it, it's really something I get to think about, something I get to love. He earned his ticket to the NCAA championships with a jump just a couple inches shy of seven feet. It's pretty awesome coming from where I've come from, coming from being a walk-on to being kind of just somebody who jumps and competes for fun to, you know, taking it to the next level. It's kind of crazy. The Lobo turned Vaquero hopes his story of overcoming obstacles can inspire other Valley athletes.